Hi, my name is Muzi and welcome to the channel that talks ideas and today's topic is learning and improving with experience. Now, first things first, whatever it is that you are doing, there is no way that you can be excellent at it when you first start. So you have to start whatever it is that you have to start and then learn and, and improve as you go along. Uh, so the main talking points for today are, number one, the issue of small batching. So now when you're first starting off, you first start, start, start selling your product or offering your service, you don't want to buy an entire shipping container of goods and try and then come back and try to sell to customers that you've never tried to sell to, sell to before. So you start with small numbers, sell to your customers, see how it goes, get a feeling of how everybody is, is uh, get everybody's reactions to the products. We'll see whether they like it or not, the pricing, the colors, the packaging, everything. So you start from your small batch, see how it goes and then you go to a bigger batch and then eventually you build up to the big container loads and then all and then another thing is always review your progress so now whenever whenever you, you have sold something you've made a particular design you review how customers reacted to 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 your to your initial offering see how much how much you made uh <clears throat> what everybody liked and didn't like and then you, you make you make changes as you go along and you improve with experience um, yeah update and continue so now that you've sold you sold your stuff or you've told, you talked to people about your idea then you come back to to your plan and then you update whatever it is that you were writing on or your main your main points or your main offering and then you continue with it um, and then another important thing Mistakes are a part of life. Like it or not, you will always make something. Make we will always make mistakes. Something is going to slip through the cracks somehow, in some way, and by the time you realize it, 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 it most probably will be too late. So you're gonna need to learn how to work to work with mistake and to live with the mistakes that you make. So this ties in to that. You are much better off making a mistake. In 10 items then making a mistake in 10,000 items that are inside a container ship being shipped from China uh, so this is where we it really comes in so you sm you small batch whatever it is that you have to offer right you sell it you review and then you update and continue and then as you continue you do another you need to do another batch so it's all about patching your progress you, you, you do another batch, sell it or, or experiment or implement whatever it is that you want to implement and then you, you improve as you go along because these are part of life. You'll always make mistakes and the thing is with mistakes is they don't even have to be your own. You could do everything on your side perfectly and then have a supplier mess up a shipment or have an employee or a partner do something that they, that they were not supposed to do in whatever way that they were supposed to do it in. So, you're going to learn to, to work with that a lot. Because whenever you are doing something new, something is going to go wrong. So, and yeah, so that, that is the basic crux of today's video is just learn and improve with experience. Everything, everything is going to, everything gets better. Uh, I remember even, I think on the previous video, that video had spelling errors in it. Uh, I saw it later on and I realized, no, I didn't have much time to fix it. I just put it out as is because if I try to go back, redo another video and all of that, it was going to take too much time. I was going to miss my deadlines. So I just said, okay, Muzi, live, live with the mistakes and then you'll fix it as you go along. So I hope everything is fine on, on the flip chart for today. Um, so yeah, just to recap, make sure you learn and improve with experience. You don't want to be stuck at the same place for, for, for too long. So, and the best way to do that is this, you implement in small batches. Implement in small batches, update, review, you fix your mistakes or you fix your feature, and you add your feature requests that come from customers. And, and yeah, and then with time, everything gets better. With time, your skills get better. With time, everything, you, everything improves. Everything improves. And yeah, so thank you for watching today's video. And remember, we're gonna I'm gonna be posting one to three videos per week. So subscribe for notifications, and I will see you on the next one.